on the line. The hate is real. The tension is real. These two are going to be tied together in six rounds super match format. It is the time for your main event. Ladies and gentlemen, last time this man was here, he had all kinds of matches. There was blood on the table and he had match of the year. Almost one of the best matches of all time. Can he do it again? Put your hands together for easy money, Dave Chafee. Easy money, Dave Chafee, right now. He's been very, very quiet, very, very composed the whole week. And I really hope we will see something, something, maybe a little bit evil coming out of him. Going hard against everything Devin Lareth has thrown at him. He's been super quiet. Every, every time Devin works on his annex and just trying to make this into a fight before a fight, Dave's been really chill. I just don't want to see it on table. I just don't want to see it on table. But I think he's super angry. If I would be Dave, I would be definitely very, very angry. And I would be... And we know Dave is ready. Yes, yes. We see the emotions. He's ready and he is taking no prisoners in this one. But he has someone on the other side of the table and he wants to rip his arm off. But this guy is the most influential arm wrestler on the planet and he is changing the game every time he comes to the table. Ladies and gentlemen, this is No Limit, Devon. Larry! And this is the main event. The man, the legend, Devin Larratt. He is the reason arm wrestling is so big. He believes he is the true king of North America. He believes he can still give a fight with everyone on the planet. And this is definitely a grudge match. <laughs> what a song! What a song! He's got a countdown from the old Sesame Street. Oh, the ultimate the troll. Ultimate troll, ultimate troll. I was I was expecting him to walk out in a suit, to be honest. I tell you, Devin is playing 4D chess while everyone's playing checkers when it comes to the mind game. I did love the fire war cry. Look at those stats Six there. Six foot five, 283 pounds, two pounds heavier. I love that picture. That picture should be everywhere yeah that, uh, he, that's that's the that's the mug shot you get when you've been drunk and driving you know yeah a hundred this sure. is that's unreal right. totally. that's 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 right. Right. ladies and gentlemen round number one everyone Close is hands. really excited Go! Yeah, man! Oh. Yeah, buddy! and now feels like Gavin is in good position straight away dave goes for that side pressure trying to get back his is wrist got, is that all you got already oh my oh my Good turn throughout the hand. Absolutely redlining. Oh, we are in for a night. We are in for a night, Dave. Eh? We are in for a night. That's a foul. Is that a running foul? foul. <laughs> Was that a running He will hit that back pressure, get the control of the hand. And he's trying to go inside, and he did. He's inside a hook straight from the go. Don't be crying. the go. He's inside in a hook. Inside. Wow. Devin Lara putting on a show. Bang. Round one. This is not even close to their first match on WL. This is not even close to that first match. Devin told me if he will stop him outside, he's like, I'll feel if I can go inside, I'll go inside. And that's exactly what he did. Look at, he almost lost his hand, but Dave didn't go for a clear top roll. Gets the hook in, says, Dave was already giving up there. Devon waits, lets him set up deeper, and then just hey, rotates in. So massive, Dave? And there it have you is. Have seen me so massive? And he continues to talk. Hey, Devon I, I, don't, I don't think Dave was ready for Devon to go inside. I don't think he recognized that he was going to go inside. So this is why he kind of stopped him. Because he had a clear access to his pronator, but he didn't use it because he was expecting the top roll. No nickname saying he's got no limits in this one. Devon is just in full control. 
Will he go inside with him in round two? Will he play with his food and just spend all of Dave's tickets? As you can hear, both men breathing heavy. Dave more so than Devon. And, of course, we always question Dave Chafee's endurance. Even though he's had bangers at King of the Table, we'll see where this goes. We're still at round number one. I don't see that much engagement. I don't see the explosiveness we saw back in it. Or... Or Center it's Devon eight. that just got that there much go. better. Right he said he's twenty percent stronger since the last time they met, and it absolutely looked like that. It looked like that. He looks absolutely. Maybe we will see shape. a flash pin from Devon again. Oh, Devon's shoulder. coming kind of yeah. forward yeah. with his shoulder. Let's see which lane he will pick. Go! He went for a back pressure. Ah! With the hand control. Ah! Ah! The big war cry. The big scream. Gets in all kinds of positions and made it real uncomfortable for Dave Chafee. Devin Larratt has just gone bang and he draws first blood. What does Dave Chafee do now, Ray, in order to get back in this one? Fire up. Fire up. Get more aggressive. I think he needs, like, he was still very slow. I have seen Dave just explode. And even here, of course, Devin is really strong and it looks like that. But if Devin's going inside with him... That's where you need to stop him. That's where you need to go. Unreal stuff there. Look at the replay. Dave just giving it everything. We know the wow. horsepower that he has. So for Devin to be able to re return serve and get the job done. I just want to say how impressive that was from Devin Larratt. He called him in the center. He took all control in the center line. Not the pin line like it used to be. Mm. Right? This has been insane evolution from Devin Lard we have seen. Ever since his match versus Levin Sagnashvili, right here, close to a year ago, I think a year and a few days, where he tore his bicep, he's coming back in an absolutely amazing shape with different matches, with different opponents, pulling all over the place, left and right, what we always wanted to see from Devin Lard. Yeah, the Devon swagger is kicked in. 1-0 to Devon Larratt, your main event here at King of the Table. All matches start in the strap. As Ray mentioned earlier, this is King of the Table rules. As now Dave is just trying to get as much around Devon's hand as he can in order to hit that side pressure. But he just needs to put the foot to the metal. He, just, he needs everything. Every single ticket that he has, he needs to spend it. I tell you, Dave, just that horsepower. Load up the cannon, fire it off. Not much talking now going. Now, Devin feels that he's got him. He's got his hand on the strap there. Dave is looking not even sweating that much. Right? Well, hopefully. He's got plenty left in the tank, Ray. Hopefully that's, he's going to be up That's what I'm looking at. Maybe he's conserving himself. Maybe he has... Open. A game plan Open. for Open. this one. So it's, it's very hard to beat Devon Larratt if you lost the first round. Oh, it's it's very hard. Absolutely. Absolutely. And you saw in that first round, you thought Devon was doing origami the way he folded Dave's wrist back in order to get the pin. It is pure talent what Devon is doing there. Continually evolving and becoming a better arm um, wrestler. King of North America, Devon has drawn first blood. Where will round two go? Sorry. It's, it, you're pulling, this is the oh, center. You can see that That's Devin was still playing mind games before the first round, before he took full control, and now he kind of stopped. This is not a center. He feels this is center he has right confidence that he will be absolutely no, I'm not. every position you're pulling me off check. center. Well, you've got me off center right now. Is our overhead camera here? That's the middle there. Devin wanting more cameras. The overhead camera. Sorry, mate, we don't have that one just yet. Wrist. Give me some wrist. Open. Shoulders, both of you guys. Shoulders, shoulders. We don't have one over Round the top, but two. that's right. Here we go. Fingers are close. No moving, gentlemen. Yeah, let's get up and about. Here we go. Round two. Dave, have you got anything? Or is it Devin Lara going to get the job done? Dave is kind of giving up his hand. And goes for yeah. a little better position. Yeah, 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 Dave. Dave. yeah, yeah buddy. Oh. Yeah, give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me, Dave. Tell everybody, tell everybody, Dave. Yeah, Devin Remember sitting me, in a Dave. real Remember me. position. <laughs> Remember me, Dave. Remember. Remember me, Dave. Remember me. 
Don't, don't forget man. about me. Dude. I'll get some rest. Stay don't there. forget about me. You want to let me rest? There oh, it is. Remember absolute me. domination from Gavin Lart. Absolute domination. Too massive. I'm sorry. I can't <laughs> this too man strong. is too massive. He was two pounds heavier than Dave Chafee. <laughs> <laughs> but you just see there, once Devin just gets in that comfortable position, huge hit there. It is unbelievable that power to outpower Dave Chafee is something else. And then once he gets in that position, he has made Dave all sorts of uncomfortable there. And you see he's holding there and just waiting, bleeding destroying him. Not only does he want to pin his arm, but he wants to take his soul with him. I think this builds insane confidence of Devin Lard just beating opponent of Dave Chafee has been super active. He's been pulling almost every super heavyweight on the planet. And the way that Devin is beating him right now, there's not a lot of guys that have done it before. Uh, most recently we saw Revas Lutidze. Just absolute domination. And I think for Devin it is an absolutely needed testing for himself to see how can he do in those heavyweight rankings right now. We're yeah. going to go to round number three. Yeah, Devin really wants to climb the super heavyweight rankings. So he's starting back here. Usually the gatekeeper when it comes to super heavyweight. You get a win over Dave Chafee and you start climbing the ranks. He's now got two on him. He looks like he's got two more. Now Dave just trying to figure out where he wants to hit and where he wants to go. Power, we need more than just power. Dave has a technical side of him. We just need him now to open up the book of arm wrestling tricks and take a couple out for him. What he did, getting in, there. in my opinion, what he did a little bit wrong was he trying to still get the hand control in that second round. Uh, he tried to get the hand control in that match and he allowed Devin to drive to the side, getting his arm out of his shoulder. And then he committed to a flopper's press without his shoulder behind his arm. And it's very hard to pretty much get, do something there. If he maybe, maybe, it's not the best choice, but straight away go for that side pressure flop wrist, that, that what we call Jerry, straight away. Maybe that's a key at least to open up them alert. Now, I know he'll be watching this match carefully, and he might even debate about King of North America. But we are here, definitely, for the King of North America. Devin Larratt in full control there. Can we get a King of the Table 5 action that Dave did last time? Flop, wrist, press, dive in there. Get that shoulder behind you, Dave. But Devin just looking calm. Looking yeah, every, every match, I feel like Dave is giving up too much of his hand. There's Dave's wife, Amber, there looking on, just hoping that her man can just absolutely rip through it and get a pin and make a match of this one. Close hands. Here we go. Yeah! Bang! Yeah! Now yeah! Devin getting the shot inside. We are in the middle of the table. Let him go. It's Good right, control baby. over pronator. Right. Good. Hand is really deeply cupped. Good shoulder behind. Oh, just textbook hook. Devin Larratt, side pressure, hook. It's a breathing, breathing time here. And now he's and just, just sitting there. Up. Jody's having an easy day yeah, at the I'm office because Devin is I'm taking good. care of business in this one. Back here. It's just uh, sitting him. And now he's nothing. given nothing. Dave some nothing. leeway. Boom. And they're just having a chat. <laughs> Dave was just Absolute resting. Absolute domination from Devin Larratt. There you go. Amber just not looking too happy. 3 nil, Devin Larratt. Hey, I got this one, Dave. I got this one. Total control. Let's go to the replay, Ray. He's just in Look, full control there. Absolutely. So close. Wrist is so cupped and just full access to everything he wants. Dave is out of it. Like, Dave's body is... Devin is twisted sideways. There's no getting out of it. There's no getting out of it. It's very hard. You need to engage him sim sim like similarly. You yeah. have to win the side pressure game. You have to win the center. If you don't win the center, you'll not get Devin and, out of it. And then the exclamation point right here to just ram the fist wow. into this it. Is, he never turns off this Devin. Is a this is a slaughter. Yeah. We're looking at a slaughter. Well, that's... I think, Oh, yeah. That's probably the perfect word to describe this one, Ray. I'd have to give you that. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, land to the slaughter <laughs> at the moment. I feel like Devin, is, Devin will go for that Kings ball. I think he's, he's having so much fun now. 
You, you don't see it, but he has. <laughs> he, he already made all the points he wanted to make. He beat Dave in a hook straight from the first round. He dominated. He didn't go for the king's move. He got a nice open top roll that wasn't even close to a king's move or, you know, whatever. Well, I'll tell you what, Ray. I like to rewrite my wrong. So when Devin gets into the king's move, you give me the nod mm. and I'll call a proper king's move, not like the last king of the table okay. where I absolutely butchered it. Did you? Did you? I, I, I didn't notice it. Dave, good. Double king, yeah. Dave? What do you think? You double king? All you're doing is getting the yeah. strap on. Devin is saying Wait, double king, Dave? Thing. What do you think? <laughs> double king? <laughs> double kings. Let's get it going. Hey, let's go. Side by let's side go. pitcher. But we'll see if he goes into the king's move. Because I feel like Devin laid off the gas pedal. He feels he has full control. Whatever this match goes, inside, outside, he has everything. Dave, Dave, I wanted to see more emotions from Dave. I really thought that Devin got under his skin, but he's so calm, and he's probably one of the nicest guys in Arbor Slip. Oh, yeah. Dave's a great guy. He's, he's an introvert. Yeah. You know, uh, he just wants to turn up and pull. The, to get the yes. big flex and scream at the start was unreal. So I was with you, Ray. Controversy at the press conference. And now it's here. Round four. No I moving, feel gentlemen, no moving. Be ready, be ready, Jake. Close your hands. Here we go. Yeah. Big bang. <laughs> yeah. yeah, equivalent size boy. <laughs> yeah, equivalent size boy. <laughs> oh, there it is. He has called it. The, uh, the airs boy. Be, oh, Dave. <laughs> no, equivalent no, size do boy. Don't do it, Dave. It's not there. It's not there, uh, Dave. Dave. It's not there. You're going to hurt yourself. So you're going to hurt yourself. Oh, Devin, just in full control there. Give Can it up. Can opener! <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Can opener. Oh. Looks dead eye Devin in the Lars. camera. 4-0 oh, wow. wins this match decisively and dominantly. That's pretty much it. Absolutely yeah. That's domination. Much it. So what other I'm just tricks? happy... I won one round. I it would be close. <laughs> Probably Superman. <laughs> so what What other tricks are we going to have now? Because you, as you see Devin in the replay here, just look dead in the camera. How you going, mate? And then the cry happens. Can opener. Can opener. <laughs> I, I think Devin should just go through the, all the catchphrases right now. You know, whatever we're missing, right? Yeah, buddy. We need, yeah, buddy. So if you're playing bingo at home, Devin Bingo, <laughs> right. and start marking off all the, the yeah. catchphrases that he's saying. But look, this is no disrespect to Dave Chafee, you and I are having a laugh in the booth. Yeah. It's just showing the difference between the two. Devin, at the moment, when it comes to North American arm wrestling, is on another level. There's challenges there about. I feel like there's the match... And I'm sorry I have to talk about it right now, yeah. but it's Jerry, right? Jerry Catteret and yeah. Devin Larratt make that happen for number one in North America. And Devin didn't even have to use his secret guys. weapon. And it's not no secret. It's sitting right there and showing four fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Has Dave got anything left in the tank? Can he get a pin? Can he get up and about? The big man. He's breathing a lot heavier now. What other tricks will the magician, Devin Larratt, have up his sleeve there? We've seen a lot of weapons being whipped out. Devin's slowly turning into a Swiss Army knife. What else is left? Yeah, it's it's pretty much what Devin will figure out to do. He will do it. Maybe he will go a flop wrist press or something because he can pretty much do anything he wants in this match right now. Has full access. I think they m might not look tired. He's kind of smiling all the time, and he's, you know, think, uh, he's like uh, accepting the reality. Think, but uh, it's very, my hand to beat you? it's very one-sided. It? Devon has everything. Oh. You need it? And he's still talking. He's still talking. <laughs> he never stops. I was, I was surprised he could do it for hours every single day. We've been here in Dubai, but yeah, yeah I think Devon, Devon broke this match. All the way, just showing dominant. And to be honest, I really like this version of Devon. I can't wait to see him more on our wrestling table. And he's been pulling like crazy. This is like, I would say, his sixth or seventh super match this year. And we are just at the end of June. Yeah, the most active arm wrestler, one of the right most now. active. Absolutely. Yeah, in and, the world. And people 
were saying like, oh, Devin just pulls once or twice a year. And he's like, okay, I'll, yeah. I can pull more. Yeah, <laughs> I'll pull every day. Yeah. That's what he's doing at the moment. He can absolutely do that. Absolutely do that. And what a name. What a scalp he's taking Devin today. Devin is going straight inside. Dave should have been closer with his shoulder. Just come forward. Just come forward and just try to win that side pressure. He can't, like, even in the setup, Dave is so out of his shoulder. Mm. Like, he's so easy for Devin just to push through. and. Like Devin is already rotated fully yeah, in. He's trying to pull that shoulder. Devin so close. You can see it, right? Everyone can see it. He just drops it this back. This is a yeah, little bit more yeah, shoulder. of shoulder. Gennady's pull, pull back. match. Right, right, right. But Dave needs to come Close forward. Dave needs to come forward and hit it. Go! Oh, 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 what? 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 Came in. It, the, I'm right on the go. One foul. Oh, come on. One, One foul, foul for Devin. <laughs> He wants to get it done. Little smirk on his face. He's dived in. Bill says carving in before the go. Very good timing for Devin. Of course he was. So he's going. Of course he was. So now he's coming in for the press. So this is the the new trick that he's got. Is that a warning shot to others? How do you fall start when you just say go? All you said was go, Dave. How do you fall start when you just say go? That's a great question, to be honest. Let's see. Let's see what happens now. Dave area. needs, like, Dave knows what's going to happen. Why but I, I believe, so like, Dave is done. He looks not. like he's done. He's not only. Yeah, what there's a no back pressure Devin's engagement. In. Yeah. And Devin is still in that match. All righty. Here we go. Round go! five. Ah! He's dropped in. Oh! Nice catch. Oh! Very good catch. Oh! oh! His drive now. Dave is deep into it. The crowd has lost it. Devin was playing with his food, waiting for the press. Dave caught him up an outfielder in baseball. Let's go, Dave. Let's go. Transition too late, but Dave has his shoulder behind him. Yeah, equivalent size boy. <laughs> there it is. That was a much better round. Much, much better, better round. round. I great catch. Great stop considering his round five. Devin too easy. Too easy. And Dave cashed him and brought him back in a great fashion. But not quite there. still, <laughs> not quite there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Testing it all there. Hey, but I like the fight in Dave Chafee. Yeah. to able to stop. He, he played dead on everyone. He's like, <laughs> uh, you know, just... Uh, and then he... He did great. He absolutely did great. He was playing possum, but yeah, and uh, that yeah, much better round, much better fight from Dave Chafee, just ensuring that he wasn't going to get pinned with the press. It's the way he was able to hold Devin there. But then when Devin was in ultimate defensive position, the way he was just able to bring it back to the A side, bring it back to his side of the table, the old S Club Seven, bring it all back to him, Devin Larratt. Is just something else. He's showing a different form today. Just see the look there from Dave Chafee. Now, I don't want to bring it up, but I'm going to. Last time Dave was at King of Taylor, he may or may not have a special commentator in his corner helping him out. So is that the X Factor? I feel that is the X Factor. <laughs> that is the X Factor. Oh, no chance. Nah, that was good. So as we check the replay here, Ray, just much better, much better. Uh, I would love to see that stop from Dave. Yeah. Be going but right here. The, the, the readjustment from Dave, when he tried to transition into a press, I think that's when Devin got full control and was yeah. able to sit on top as, of his hand. As soon as Dave kind of came up, Devin just pulled him back, used his own body weight to get in that position. We're round six. So here we go. We've got it in there. As they get, they're applying the strap. Remember, every round starts in a strap. We've got one foul on Devin Larratt. So here we go. Get them together. Great effort in that last round from Dave Chafee. Can we get a little bit more action in this round? Dave is still fighting. He's still fighting. I think he's, um, of course, you don't want to give too much to Devin and you don't want to fight him because he will just drain you dry. Let me just get right? strap on. Okay. Oh, once Devin smells blood, oh, he becomes yeah. ultra his, hungry. His first nickname was the vampire and we pretty much see the coming back of the vampire. Oh, he's, he's done it now. And even now, five pins in, the intense look on Devin Larratt. He still wants it. He wants to get the broom out and make this a clean sweep. Dave Chafee, he's just got pride on the line in this one. Integrity here. 
Oh, Jody calling it. Double, Double Kings. Thumbs down. Double Kings. Go, on, yeah. Go on. I would love Dave to take the last one. Yeah, perfect. But uh, even yeah, here, yeah. you can see Dave giving up the hand. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go a little bit. Oh, they drop it there. Double Kings. <laughs> Double Kings. There it is. They are both right under the table, crossing each other's legs. Whose King's move is stronger? Devin is kind of giving up, working on that humorous bone in good position, giving up to Dave. Can Dave so maybe low. stand up, jump into that press? So low, and 75% so of the people watching the pay-per-view have just so thrown low. up at home because they're seeing the double kings. Oh, rock the cradle. Wow. Bang. Devin Larrett. Congratulations. Devin ladies and gentlemen. What an arm wrestler. Just becoming better and better every time we see him. People talk about prime. I would believe this is the prime, Devin. This is... Devon at his best. Absolutely dominating from the go, from the start in every position. Oh, One of the strongest. Oh, <laughs> One of the strongest pullers on the planet, which is Dave Chafee. And Dave has been one of the best guys. He's the gatekeeper and I hope it's no bad blood between them. They 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 respect each other. And Devon just wanted a guy that will fight him. And will he have that guy? I believe there's one guy in North America right now who can give a match to Devin Larratt. Dave Chafee coming out. Finally, I saw some emotions for the whole week. He's been really quiet, and he's an intervent. And then Devin Larratt coming out with a Sesame counting song, just being classic Devin. And right from the go, Devin has the control of the hand of the side pressure and then he goes inside which is kind of insane from the first round and he said he wanted to do and they was already ready to give up there but tried and Devon just absolutely dominates and then we saw a replay one more time a restart sorry for the round one we see Devon Larry just absolutely being the best version he has ever been he said last time they met, he's 10, 15, 20% stronger, and you have to believe him. Absolutely dominating inside, outside, having fun on table. Dave Chafee tried his best to win this match, but couldn't. Devin Larratt, 6-0 victory. We see him return after the first, after the first king of the table. He won Michael Todd, then John Berzenk, then loss to Levan Saganishvili. Now victory over. Dave Chafee. We will see more of him for sure. And there's so many challengers to take. And Devon will never give us a boring match. Dave Chafee gave up his best, but wasn't enough. And right now, has to lay down to the king of North America. We see Jody very happy there, showing 4-0. Round number five, Dave Chafee surprised us all with a great start. And we saw a little bit of <clears throat> double king's move that we didn't want to see. But it was clear domination from Devin Laird. Having fun on table all throughout six rounds, dominating. Uh, big.